and giving us some perspective. Well, the market is uh, pretty much ending at the lowest levels of the day, so there's no sign of uh, buyers emerging just yet. Second day running, we've had a week, week close. Friday was the first and then it's been followed up by this Monday. So about a percent lower on the Nifty with a cut of 250 points. Uh, banks and IT, those twin engines, really leading this spiral down that we've seen. The Bank Nifty is ending with a cut of over 800 points. That That's over 1.5%. And the Nifty IT, if you pull up the Nifty IT, well, yeah, that's also down about a percent and a half. So we talk about the, the loser's tally on the large cap screen. And uh, the names will reflect ICICI Bank down to 2.5%. HDFC Bank down about a percent and a half. Lever uh, is one of the other big names, LNT and Lever, some heavyweights which were doing a little more damage on the downside. And then, of course, IT stocks. Let's start with TCS, down a percent and a half. Uh, the commentary not really enthusing the street. And the others as well. It's uh, Pierce, Set Tech, Mahindra, HCL Tech. Most of these stocks have had a weak session. So on large caps, uh, just a few commodity names, Prashant, uh, which managed a little bit of green. But otherwise, it was a pretty widespread fall today. Yeah, no, absolutely. And... Uh... You know, uh, just a few other names here. Uh, but, but I have to say, though, that the list of volume-led gainers, even though it's, uh, it's completely one-sided, declines, outnumbering advances, that ratio. But if you add one more element to that mix, which is volumes, and what went down in volumes, or the number of stocks which went down in heavy volumes as compared to the number of stocks which went up with heavy volumes, I mean, you know, it'll be... Uh, uh, you'd, you'd have to give it to what went up, because there... Lots and lots of names with volumes doing well, even though, I mean, the aggregate number far smaller than what went down. So, uh, just a few names, right? I mean, uh, Thermax, you had uh, CPCL, Anandrati, we were talking about Ashiana earlier, a CSB Bank is, uh, at 400 bucks, Purvankara, uh, and then, of course, Excite, Aster DM, etc., some of the other names that we've been continuing to discuss here. Uh, in the large caps, it's largely been just, I mean, ONGC and Hindalco. Otherwise, uh, you know, it's been more down than up, uh, really speaking. So that's uh, the picture with uh, this uh, Monday's trading session down 240 points lower. But the defensive 20 day, the 20 day moving average, uh, hope floats that, uh, that perhaps we'll be able to hold, hold on to it. So two times the market's gone and hit that 20 day and then recovered. Uh, so the close is about 15 points above uh, the 20 day moving average on the FT. It's a wrap on this edition of uh, Closing Bell from all of us here. Goodbye. Thanks very much for staying with us. But both Surubi and I will get you markets forward. That will come up after a quick commercial break. Don't go anywhere. Stay with us. Thanks for tuning in to CNBC TV 18. And for more news and updates, follow us on all the social media platforms.